Hello everyone, this is just an update video on what I've been up to. Um, I've actually programmed a pick and see for once in my life and uh, programmed it to make a video signal and I even made it animate. Um, I've been learning C lately in, uh, for the uh, DS pick series of microcontrollers and uh, yeah, I'll show you what I've got here. I've got a little airplane flying. It's not much, but, you know, for something that's only running at 20 million instructions per second, it does pretty good. Uh, for most of my timing, I'm using interrupt request, uh, the timer 1 module, in fact, to uh, interrupt the microcontroller for uh, the synchronization pulses. So every 90 or so instructions will do in the uh, horizontal sync pulse, and uh, once it gets done with the scan line, it goes through and does the uh, vertical sync pulse or pulses, I should say, through the timer 1 interrupt. As for actual video data, the level data, that all has to be done in real time, so there's not much I can do with that for, uh, you know, in between processing or anything, but every other, all the other time, uh, for the rest of the timing, you know, the microcontroller is only busy working with the video signal sync pulses whenever it needs to change uh, a bit on the output, and uh, the rest of the time it's just, you know, it's got time to do user program data or uh, user program processing and uh, right now I'm actually using the user program time to generate the correct bit sequence to uh, make the letters and the airplane and to animate the airplane flying from the bottom to the top I know it's not much of an airplane but you can't do much with uh, just 8-bit pixels or not 8, eight pixels wide monochrome uh, video data uh, one of the things I plan on actually doing later on with this microcontroller, um, this video generation is actually just an exercise to learn C and how to use this specific microcontroller and its peripherals. Um, I actually plan on uh, using this for my induction motor control project and electric vehicle drive systems. Um, let me know if you have any ideas or questions. I'll try to answer them the best I can. Um, oh, that's for another video, though. Anyhow, thanks for watching.